This is my work and it's called Psalm 85. Actually, it's a, the beautiful Psalm 85 that inspired this work. And uh, every time I hear it, it, you know, in the liturgy each year, I, it would make me feel so uh, inspired that such the beautiful words and what would it look like to have the, this, these sentiments as part of our, our regular lives. And I, and I keep wondering, well, how would one bring those words to, to some kind of image? And I did many drawings, and finally I got to uh, this basic landscape, like an undulating landscape, like uh, the kind that were done in the, in the United States during the, the teens and the 20s, the 1920s and 30s, and the, uh, uh, the American regional painters. And, uh, and Grant Wood was one of the important ones. And, uh, and so, but also what inspired it uh, were the, uh, the farm workers and the ideas of uh, people sharing the, the foods and the lands and there was enough for everyone that people could live. And, but the words, you know, the justice and peace show kiss is such a beautiful one. And I showed two friends running to meet each other. And then, uh, truth shall spring out of the earth's earth. So I see the beautiful um, tree and the, the uh, the man watering the tree, but people are so excited that this beautiful tree, and it's like the all the birds are coming to be there, and people see it as the shade during. Um, and so the idea is truth springing out of the earth. The tree is like this beautiful symbol of truth, and and the people are are excited about it. And I like the the child. Uh, climbing the tree and people standing there admiring the tree. And I, then you see other elements. You see this, this lady here feeding the chickens. And the chickens are they're leaving eggs around. And the, and the father is holding his son up. And I, I, people in I, here in this valley in Thousand Oaks, it's called Conejo Valley. And Conejo means a rabbit. So this is a, the Valley of the Rabbits. And, and it's fun, the people found it and, and right away they, they claimed this picture as Conejo Valley as part of this picture belongs to that. And then the interesting part of the kindness and truth shall meet is part of the this beautiful Psalm 85, and I have uh, two women above uh, scattering the seeds or sowers, and I uh, and then also I have people being kind to each other, and neighbors greeting each other, and respecting each other, and knowing that if one had a problem, they that the neighbors would help them. I uh, also look in the tree, there's a nest there. <laughs> I put a bird, birds with a nest. And then above you see all the people working the land. Uh, they're plowing the fields. And then and this beautiful, uh, well, it's almost psychedelic, <laughs> this, this skyscape uh, with a uh, uh, a burst of sun sun rays, and then it's so it's been like uh, a mist of like from after the rain, the ground's real real uh, ready for working on, and then this beautiful rainbow, and then I, 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 I the the words that are the part that I chose from the song, justice shall look down from the heavens. And, and I kept thinking about justice, watching and trying to bring equity and fairness to for all people, and that um, uh, there wouldn't be so much greed, greed, but there would be more people able to share and not uh, 
be avarice and claim it so much that they exclude other people. And, and it's important, this is an important piece for me because it, it tries to capture some of the, the spirit that I feel of, uh, and trying to connect with the words that I hear and trying to make some kind of imagery to bring to people and hopefully that they would enjoy it, that they would, that it would inspire them too. Thank you so much, John.